Hey everybody, how y'all doing today? Uh, as promised, we're back out here to kind of talk about the first step in our plan that we had for our journey to the AT. Uh, we decided to do a one day hike, just a day hike down at uh, the Knobstone Trail there in Southern Indiana. So to prep for that, we came over to this trail, they call it the Panhandle Pathway. This is kind of what the Panhandle looks like now. This is uh, winter, but uh, it's the same obviously, but it's pretty nice. It's kind of out here in the country, quiet. There's just roads that cross the trail at this point of the trail, but it's kind of nice. Which was a rail to trails type thing. Uh, we brought our bicycle over here, uh, we rode the trail, we uh, hiked the trail or walked the trail. I'm not quite sure what the uh, dictates a trail or a hike and a walk I mean I'm not sure I guess you guys would have to tell me but anyway we came out here uh, probably late summer early fall uh, started walking uh, every weekend I think uh, then we uh, brought our old 10 speed bicycle over Chance to show you old blue here. I got me a pad I bought for my seat. And this gets hard on my behind. And then I got the grandpa edition I made. Piece of pipe across the handlebars. So my grandpa can kind of sit up more than lean over. No 10 speed. But that's old blue. We're getting a few miles on this thing. This, like I say, is a pathway. We uh, still going north. Nice tree covered on both sides. It's quiet though. Boy, you don't hear anything. No breeze this morning either though. So I don't know. We'll keep going. Started riding the trail on our bicycle. Trying to get my legs uh, a little bit ready for the trail down there, just to see how far we could go in one day. Uh, as I talked earlier on the other video that back before that, I had reached uh, 285 pounds and uh, so I started losing weight trying to get ready just to see what I could do in a day down there. Uh, I didn't buy anything in the way of uh, equipment or gear. I made a set of uh, trekking poles for myself and my wife. I didn't video anything while we were down there, so all I can really post is pictures of and there was only a few pictures really that I took that I'll post uh, but uh, I'll show what we did for that day talk about that a little bit uh, wife and I drove down to Scottsburg Indiana got a room for the night and it was the first day of October a nice sunny day kind of like today maybe a little warmer since this is january and that was october but yeah it was a beautiful day we went out went to the trailhead on the knobstone on the northern terminus there's a, a couple loops that you can do So 
so we were intending to see how far we could go on the loops uh, just to check it out but we had a beautiful day that day uh, it's quiet in the woods uh, sunny not much wind that day so we really had a beautiful day I'm going to say we uh, got out on the trail, I don't know, about 10.30 or so. And uh, by the time we got back to our vehicle, it was probably 6 o'clock. I know Mother and I both were tired. We were ready to be back. But we did, did 8 miles that day, so I thought for a couple newbies out there that was pretty good I survived it all right so that moved me on to the next step of the plan and I'll talk about that in the next video but uh, mother she said that wasn't for her uh, so she she wasn't going to go again I want to thank you for stopping, giving my channel a look. I uh, appreciate it. Well, if you watched the video to the end, uh, I'd appreciate it if uh, you could like and subscribe. Uh, if you enjoyed it, and if you want to come back, see more. Uh, I'm still a work in progress, so just bear with me. I'm new at this stuff. Uh, I want to say God bless you for checking me out. Thank you.